Hey guys, welcome back. We are once again in my kitchen. I am once again just getting home from work, but I ran to Target on my break because I needed to get a few groceries and I figured I would show you everything that I got because along with groceries at Target, you buy some other fun stuff. So I figured I would show you everything that I got. It is late. I am tired. It has been rough. My grandmother hasn't been sleeping through the night. She's been waking up a lot and um, we're tired in this house with the time change and it getting dark early. I'm just really feeling it today. So I am looking forward to getting all this stuff put away, cuddling up in my bed with Chloe, watching a movie and going to bed so soon after this. But I wanted to get this up because I need to put all this stuff away and I wanted to film it for you guys. So, okay. Let's go ahead and just get started. I got a thing of cream of wheat. This is just the instant original hot cereal. It gets 12 packets in here. Um, they are 12 ounces in each packet. So my grandmother likes to have that some mornings. And then I got us a thing of Frosted Flakes. We both like this cereal. This is just the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes. Um, good source of eight vitamins and minerals. I love Frosted Flakes, so does my grandma. This is one of her favorites. Fruity Pebbles is my favorite, but we like this. Uh, you get 13.5 ounces. It's not the biggest thing. It's not like a family size, but we don't need that much. Okay, I got some big stuff, so let me show you guys that so I can get that out of the way. I, okay, this is a story. That story goes along with this cat food. This morning, when I was running late for work, I ran out to feed the cats and I turned the corner and there was a new kitten, a, a teeny tiny new kitten. Not one of my kittens, not one of my kittens kittens, like no one has had babies. It's just a new kitten that has found their way onto my porch with my other kittens and it's an itty bitty teeny tiny one and today it was raining and so I just fed the kitten because I don't have the heart to turn a kitten away and I'll just get it strong and healthy and then maybe adopt it out. Who knows? But anyways, I have a now an additional kitten, so that makes it five cats. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Anyways, I've got a lot of cats, so I got a lot of cat food. So this is just the Friskies by Purina. Um, there's 40 cans in here. They're seafood and chicken favorites. Let me see if I can read the... You get 10 salmon, 10 mariner's catch, 10 ocean whitefish and tuna, and 10 chicken and tuna. So yeah, they're not picky about the type of food that they eat or what they like. So I always just get them these big things of friskies because you get the most amount in the jar and um, the most amount in the box and they like it. So grab a thing of that because now I have a whole, you know, family, a whole like, I'm gonna have a ranch of of cats. All right, I got a thing of Gatorade. This is just the eight pack of the Fruit Punch Gatorade. These are the 20 fluid ounces. I love red Gatorade. I put this into my um, cup and take it to work and drink it all day. It's nice for hydration. And I got a thing of Red Bull. These are the um, 12 pack of the eight Point four ounce cans, the smaller ones. I don't need the bigger ones, so these are nice. I will go through this. It'll take me like a month or two to go through this. I don't drink them very often, but I went ahead and grabbed one because I ran out. So it's cheaper to buy them that way and then to buy them every time I buy them at the grocery store. I mean, at the liquor store or something. So I go ahead and do that. Okay, I got something that's kind of fun. I told you guys that I'm trying to make my car a little bit fun and um, make me want to keep it better. And I don't know. I don't know. I just don't like it right now. So I'm trying to make it prettier. So I found this really cool car um, steering wheel cover. My steering wheel is coming like it's leather, but it's all rubbing off. So I thought this would be so fun. And it doesn't really, it's not like hard to grip. You know, they're not like bugging me. So I thought this would be so fun. So this is by Auto Drive. It's a steering wheel cover. It says it installs in seconds, fits most vehicles, 14.5 um, to 15.5 steering wheels. So yeah, that's the brand and you just kind of stretch it over. So in my effort to make my car cute, I love that. So I picked that up. All right, one more big thing, and then we'll get into some smaller things. I picked up a bed for the cats. 
It's rainy, like I said, right now. It's starting to get cold outside here at night. So I figured this would be nice for them all to cuddle in or even just a couple to cuddle in, whatever they want. It's this like igloo. It's a convertible pet cave to cuddler. So I think you can kind of convert it and take this pillow out and like put it up there or something and make it something different. I'm just gonna put it out in the backyard. It does have this little like removable, really cushy Sherpa pillow. And it is kind of lined with um, like fleece on the inside. So I think it'll keep them really nice and warm. It's gonna get filthy outside. It's gonna get so dirty. So I figure after the season, I'll just throw it away. But um, yeah, this will be perfect for them. Yeah, Boots and Barkley, a little convertible pet cave thing. Yeah, I don't know, I was excited to find it. They only had one more, so I was excited that I was able to find it because it's cold tonight and I wanna be able to put it out for them. Okay, have a couple of bags here. I grabbed a thing of Kleenexes. Oh, it's very close to the camera right there. I grabbed a thing of Kleenexes. I like these little round ones to put on my makeup station. I bought a thing of three from the 99 cent store. The tissues are really um, not great, and so I ended up not using them. So I grabbed Kleenex because I like their tissues. So they are on the go, perfect fit, two packs. Um, you get 100 two-ply tissues in each of these little tubes, and these are really cute for Christmas time right now. So you get the llama, blah, 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 little Santa holding all the packages, and it's just a little circular thing. These fit really nicely on my vanity, so I use those in there. We needed some um, dryer sheets, so I picked up a thing of Snuggle. These are the Super Fresh 5-in-1 Spring Burst. You get 200 sheets in here, so yeah. Five in one odor elimination technology. I just love the smell of Snuggle. I've liked it since I was a kid. So I went ahead and picked those up. This April Fresh smells really good. All right, a couple of these came out, but I bought a package of these um, Danimals smoothies. They are the Paw Patrol ones. I don't really care what kind of a character I get at all, but I do like this Soaring Strawberry and Brave Berry flavors. So I picked that up. You get. 12 bottles in here and they're 3.1 fluid ounces each. I use these in the morning. I will drink one before I take my medication. I'll drink one or two and um, that's something in my stomach for me to be able to take my medication um, so I don't take it on an empty stomach and it's I'm usually nauseated in the morning so I don't really feel like having a lot but these are good. So two of them fell out and I'm able to show you the size of them. So they just these little you know, kind of shots of yogurt. And it just takes a couple of sips to get them down so it's not hard if I'm nauseous. These are just wonderful. So if you have stomach problems and need to get something down, those are a really nice little source of th something in your stomach. Okay, I have in here, let me see if I have any more. Yeah, I have some more like un unfun stuff before I get into some of the fun stuff. I picked up a thing of trash bags. I was excited to find pink ones. I know that's so stupid, but they had pink trash bags. So these are Glad Force Flex Plus. They're a steady release scent and they're cherry blossom with Febreze. You get 90 in here. Um, they fit a 13 gallon can and they are the tall kitchen drawstring bags. I'm just really excited to use the pink. I mean, how fun is that? Isn't that a pretty color too? Super excited about that. How sad that like trash bags are making me really excited. All right. I also picked up a couple boxes of this. This is the Good and Gather Indulgent Nut Duo. You get honey roasted cashews and milk chocolate covered cashews. You get 10 bags, five of each. And these are one of my favorite snacks in the entire world. Love them, throw them on my bag, take them with me to work every single day. So I grabbed a couple of those. Let's see, any more food in here? I don't, oh yeah. Not, I mean candy, but I grabbed a thing of Hershey's Kisses. I'm loving these right now. So, you know me, I cycle through candy in weird, like, weird crazy phases. So right now it's Hershey's Kisses. And these are the family pack. Um, you get 17.9 ounces in here. A lot of Hershey's Kisses. This will last me a very long time. I only ate a couple, but excited. I, I ran out of those and I haven't had them for a couple of days, so I'm excited to have my sweet treat back. Okay, I bought some clothes because it's Target and I always find something that I want. 
This is from a new designer um, that's there, like it was right in the front. It's Sergio Hudson. Pretty pink. It says it's responsible style made with at least 30% recycled polyester. So, yeah. So, these are just a really nice pair of wide-legged trousers, like work pants. And they're very long. They're super nice. They have belt loops, like can wear belts. They do kind of have the, like, pretty pleating in the front there of the leg that go down into the wide leg. And I got these because they had them in an extra, extra small, which Target does not do in their regular clothing. So I was really excited. And I do think it's kind of a beautiful, like, blue jewel toned. And if you can see the, like, pattern, I mean, like, the fabric, it is polyester, but it's, like, really a nice... It does not feel like polyester. These feel like a really nice pant. And they were $45. Worth every penny if they fit me. I have a hard time finding pants that fit me. So I'm excited to try these. I'm hopeful. I didn't try them in the store because I was on my break and I didn't have time. So I will try them at home now tonight. But I'm hopeful about them. I'm excited. Um, I found a couple of tops. So I grabbed this one. It's from Wild Fable, which is like the juniors department, but I love the um, straps on it that aren't, they're not too spaghetti straps, you know, I thought it was like nice. And then it does have a little bit of a lace detailing there. And it does have a tie, a really loose tie in the back that you can tighten or loosen to your preference. I thought that this would look really pretty with black pants and a sweater. Like this, like right now, if I can take this down a little bit and show you, I'm just wearing black pants with a bodysuit and my sweater to work today, and I kind of dressed it up with jewelry, but I thought this would be really cute with black pants and a black sweater or um, a blazer. So, yeah, just some fun little tanks to wear under that. I grabbed, okay, this tank top that I have on right now, I am going to show you a little bit because it's super nice because it comes up really high. I like the neckline on it, and then I like the square back, but it looks really nice under a sweater. So I went ahead and grabbed it in the white. So this is the exact thing that I have on. It's just in the white. These are by Wild Fable. I got a size small, and this one was $12. And I just, I'm loving the black one. I've worn it quite a few times. So I grabbed it in white. Sorry, I have an itch on my leg. Something must have bitten me. Okay, then I grabbed a few bodysuits. Let's see, I don't think about it. No, that's not a bodysuit, but I grabbed a couple bodysuits. Oh no, this isn't a bodysuit either. What is this one? Oh, this one is, okay, sorry, that's the dress. I grabbed a couple of bodysuits. I hate it when they put these plastic things on to keep the hangers on, so I'm gonna pull that off for you so you can see this. This is by A New Day. And it is just this really pretty long sleeved ribbed bodysuit that has like a really nice kind of a square neckline, if you can see that. Let me tuck the tag in so you can see that. It's not a pretty neckline. It's just very simple, long sleeved. You can see the weave there is kind of like a wavy stripe. And yeah, it's just gonna be so nice, even with those wide leg trousers and a belt, you know, with this tucked in for work with a blazer or something, it's gonna be so nice to just have a long sleeve black basic bodysuit to wear for the holidays. And then they had this one that I thought would be really nice with black pants or a black skirt. It is also by A New Day. Oh, I didn't tell you guys how much this one was, sorry. This is a size extra small and it's $20 and it's by A New Day. And then this one is also by A New Day. It is also an extra small and it's also $20. And this one is a turtleneck bodysuit. That's kind of like a black and tan abstract print. It's long sleeved. It's just a really like um, soft cotton material. It's a mock turtleneck. And I thought this was going to be really nice with black pants and a blazer or a sweater or whatever for work. Or even jeans and a, a leather um, 
bomber jacket or something for you know the holidays that'll be so cute i think that's so pretty it's a great layering piece i picked up one of my favorite bras these are by true and co i'm gonna show you they're by true and co though this isn't the one that i'm wearing um i mean i don't have one on right now but usually the one that i have is a, a slimmer strap so this is the first one i've ever gotten in this style but they have multiple different styles and the thing about them is they're not wired. They're um, non-wire bras that really still lift you and make you feel like you have support. So this is um, called the V-neck. Let me see if I can. So if you can see, it has like a lower scooping front there. The front is lower and the back is also a V. So if you have a lower cut top or a lower cut back or even just a regular, these are nice under everything. I needed a new black one, so I went ahead and grabbed this one. They didn't have the other style that I usually get, but I figured this one would be nice. And they're just really nice, big bands, super comfortable, seamless under everything, just amazing, amazing bras. And they are $22.99. Is that going to... That's probably not going to focus. They're $22.99. Absolutely amazing. Completely highly recommend if you need a bra and you don't like underwire. These are so comfortable. They wash up amazingly. I don't do anything special with them. I wash them and dry them. I don't hang them. I don't do anything and they wash up nice. I have, I have two. I have one in black, one in nude that I have had for months and months. And I'm finally buying a new black one just because I don't want to have to wash that one every week. Every few days, whatever, you know? Okay, one more clothing item. This is also from Wild Fable. Wild Fable is kind of their juniors section, but they have a lot of things that are extra smalls and smalls, so that's where I go. So this is a dress. Let me tuck this in so you can see the cutout portion. It is this body conscious, like, not a mini skirt, but not long either. It goes right above the knee. It's just a long sleeve and it's just ribbed and it's this beautiful olive green color, but it has this really cool cutout thing at the neck here. It doesn't go low at all. It's just at your neck, but it's kind of a little bit of a peekaboo thing here at your neck. And I thought that was really pretty. And so I thought this would be really cute with my boots and um, cause I have to wear my docks for work cause it's non-slip, you know? So I figured with my docks, and a jacket or a sweater or even like a vest over this. I mean, how cute is this? It's going to be able to layer so many different ways and I love it so much. I thought that was adorable. Oh, that was $18. Super reasonably priced for that Wild Fable stuff. All right. I, of course, got some beauty stuff too because, you know, I could not. And I did need some stuff, so I got some stuff to try. Okay. A couple of things I needed, a couple of things I just got because I wanted to try it. I needed a new moisturizer because I ran out of the fancy one from Paris that my mom bought me that I absolutely adored, but I ran out of it. So, you know, dang it, I don't have that anymore. So I grabbed this one. It's not quite the same, but people are raving about it. It's brand new. It's by Neutrogena. Neutrogena. <laughs> it's their Hydro Boost Hyaluronic Acid Moisturizer with Sunscreen. Broad Spectrum SPF 50, fragrance-free, all-day quenching hydration for soft, supple skin. Everyone's raving about it. I'm going to see what all the fuss is about. Let's see if it's a good, really moisturizing, you know. So it just comes in a little tube. That's what a lot of the things are making in the packaging. That CeraVe thing that I bought the other day had this kind of packaging too. So let's see what it looks like. It must be more sustainable packaging probably. Oh, there it goes. Okay, let's pump and see what we can get out of it. Oh, okay. Just a regular white cream. Ooh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Do you see that? Do you see? Oh, my goodness. Oh, that feels so nice. Do you see the back of my hand and how glowy that already looks? Look at the difference. Okay, we'll see how that sinks in, but that's pretty, right? Okay, super lightweight, has no fragrance at all, really is fragrance-free. Yeah, wow, it's not sticky. My hand isn't sticky. 
Okay, I'll let you know how it dries down, but that's kind of impressive. And then they also had this, which um, the Ordinary, the brand The Ordinary um, that you can buy like at Ulta and I believe Sephora or whatever, they have a thing like this and now Neutrogena has duped it, so I figured I would give it a try. It is the Skin Perfecting 9% AHA slash PHA blend. So you're getting um, two kinds of acids and it's a smoothing and brightening daily liquid it's exfoliant. So it's like a toner that you use um, for normal and combination skin. It's also fragrant free, fragrance free. Um, it says it complements skin's natural renewal process while gently lifting away dead surface skin to reveal the baby soft skin hiding underneath. So after cleansing, you apply an even layer to the face and neck. Avoid the eye area. You can do it with your fingertips or a cotton pad. Let's see what this looks like. I'm super excited about this one because I didn't know that anything had duped The Ordinary and I wanted to try that one, but I hadn't been to buy it yet. I mean, I know The Ordinary is a really reasonable brand, but probably not as reasonable as Neutrogena. So yeah, it's just a little, I think The Ordinary's is a little bit bigger of a thing, but it's the kind of same thing. And it's just a little dropper that you put on a little cotton pad or into your hands and then you splash it on your face. Does this one have a scent? No, Neutrogena stuff is really unscented now. That's kind of amazing. Anyways, super excited to dry those two. Let's feel this. Oh my gosh. Okay, run. Run to buy this moisturizer. Oh my God, okay. I'm impressed, you guys. Do you see how pretty my hand looks though? And it is the least bit greasy. It is satiny soft. Like if I wish you could feel my hand right now, satiny, soft. Let me see, I think I have my receipt here. Let me tell you how much this is because I am kind of impressed. Let's see. Oh, I'm gonna have to know the number. Let's see, is it the number there? 10251. Nope, that's not the number. So I don't know how to find the number, but these, one of these, which is, I'm guessing the moisturizer is probably more expensive than the toner. The moisturizer, I believe, is $19.69. And the toner is $15.49. Both of these are under 20 bucks. So, and this feels so amazing and so luxurious. I, it almost leaves my skin on my back of my hand softer than the one from Europe. I'm, I, I'm talking about this for 10 minutes because I'm floored by this. Run, don't walk, and get you some of this Hydro Boost moisturizer. Public service announcement. Okay, I also bought a thing of, um, I'm trying to, I, I wanna buy the watermelon dew drops from Glow Recipe, but they're expensive. So I wanted to see if maybe this would be similar. These are by Bliss. They're called Everdo Skin Enhancing Glowy Serum. It has vitamin C, niacinamide, and Sika, and there's three ways to wear it. So you can wear it over skincare to amplify skin on makeup-free days. You can wear it under makeup as a primer, or you can wear it over makeup as a highlighter on the high points of your face, which is exactly what you can do with the Glow Recipe one. So I'm thinking this might be a nice little bit of a dupe for it. So, all right, it's in the same kind of a thing. Exact same packaging, but how pretty is this? I love Bliss's packaging. Okay, let's see what this feels like on top of the moisturizer, because that's probably how I'd be wearing it if I wear it as a primer, which I plan on. Oh, okay, it's pink. I didn't expect it to be pink. Let's see what it does. Ooh, it feels really moisturizing too. Ooh. Well, that does leave you glowing, doesn't it? Difference? Wow, okay, all right. We'll see how that sits down, but nice. Okay, two more things and then we'll be done. Sorry, it's a long haul. I picked up another one of these NYX Lift and Snatch Brow Pens. I have been using it, but I didn't think mine was dark enough, so I picked up the one in Espresso. This is a little micro brush pen. It's like a little eyeliner for your brows. I love this for making little brow hairs. I've been using it for a very long time. And then I picked up this um, Maybelline Superstay Vinyl Ink Lip Color. This is something that's again all over TikTok and um, 
Pinterest and Instagram and everything. I got it in the color 40, which is witty. And we're going to see what color that is. Ooh, it's pretty. Okay. I'm glad I went with this one because I didn't want a berry. I have a lot of berries. So this is kind of a nudie, like more rose, kind of like a rosewood color. It's really pretty though. Pretty accurate to the... Anyways, I'm really excited to try that. It's supposed to stay on forever. Okay. That is so pretty, right? And not sticky at all. Just smooth and soft. This duo might be amazing. I will let you know. I will let you know. But I am very excited to be using that every day. Super, super excited. And really excited about this color. I don't think it's doing it justice under this light. There you go. Maybe a little bit. It looks more like mauve but it is just a beautiful kind of a rosy mauve. All right. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope that you guys enjoyed. I will see you very soon. Until the next time that I do, take care.